is get you it's your boy time back here with our second episode of the no money spent squad series now if you missed out on episode one go back and watch it we typed in basically every locker code so far in the game and and look we got a decent amount of mt decent amount of vc to start things off obviously the squad is still a big time work in progress now today we did see a, a, a switch in the exchange, okay? Now, obviously, RJ Bear is added into the game. Still got RJ and Patrick Ewing to choose between them. It's tough. I, I feel like one without the other is not great. If I was to choose between them, still think Patrick Ewing is probably the better choice. But if I were to grind this out right now, I still think what I'd focus on is the MT more than anything else along with that we did see demarcus cousins zion wimps and jr smith i don't think any of them are worth your mt i think boogie probably is the best over option between them jr smith not good at all zion he's fine but he is still just undersized for that small forward position so we did get all of our locker codes typed in so let's talk about what is coming up next while I do grind this New Year's event because that's where I need to start. I'm going to play a lot of Triple Threat offline to start. Now, grinding these I feel like is a great start. Now, why? Well, I can get all the way up to a Diamond Season Rewind players and some of these Season Rewind players, even for their Sapphires and Emeralds, are pretty solid. Gauntlet for Lamar Odom would be okay, but again, right now I really don't have much. This tis the season stuff is something I really can grind. But again, I need breakout players. I need NBA tournament battles players. So that's not even super easy to get done. I feel like a lot of these challenges aren't super tough. Even this tis the season present amethyst stuff. It's stuff I want to do, but I got to just focus on one thing at a time. Otherwise, it is going to be really a tough uh, just to get them all done as it stands. I guess this is something like make threes with Cavs players, rebounds with Lakers players. Eventually, I could do because that's an easy equal chance pack, but it's just going to take some time to do. The first thing I need to do is get this Jalen Suggs challenge done. So 10 assists with Magic players, six fast break points, and applying five shoes. I don't even know if I've got five shoes to apply, but that's kind of the first order of business is finding a way to apply five shoes. I have zero shoes, I think. I mean, this is going to be really difficult to find a way to apply shoes when I literally don't think I've got any shoes. I guess I've got one shoe and that's Jimmy Butler's shoe. So there's one shoe. How do I get five more shoes? Because ultimately, guys, what I want to do is get that Jalen Suggs duo. I want to get Jalen Suggs, Franz Wagner. I want to get that duo going, but I got to get shoes. I mean, do I just purchase a bunch of shoes? I mean, I guess I can do that. The sad part is, I guess, bro. We'll just, we'll, we'll buy shoes when it gets down to it. But I've got to complete the other stuff first. So for Jalen Suggs, I need 10 assists with Magic players and 6 fast break points. Do I have any Magic players even that I can use to get these assists? Perfect. Coy Anthony assists, 2 is Steph Curry. I think it needs to be in one game. 10 assists in one game. Try to pair that with Steph Curry's points, whatever else, and, and points in transition. Jalen Suggs should be coming home relatively soon. Again, the nice part about this is it should be on an easy difficulty. I might shoot a lot of mid-ranges with Steph Curry because I do need those 10 assists. But trying to... Yo, these camera angles is crazy. I forgot it was my first game on to vibration. Turn that off. Turn all of those things off. I'm going to get those 11 assists with Keontae George as well. Now, I don't know what agendas you guys want to grind out first. But making sure you're grinding agendas while you're playing this triple threat offline is important because look, it's not going to take me that much longer to, to, to grind these challenges and win a triple threat offline game compared to just getting through it as quickly as possible. It really doesn't matter a whole ton. I feel like if I if I have a 30 minute uh, XP timer, I need to use that as well. Keontae George breakout is done. 750 MT added to our collection as well. And before you blink, we're already above 10,000 MT, which is super nice to start off the No Money Spent Squad series. Get a bunch of new players as well, which is big time and unsellable Emerald Pack as well. Let's go, man. Gonna open these up before going back, checking out our agendas. Now, out of this New Year's event, I don't really care. You hope to see silver or above gold. Okay, what is that? A snowflake ball. 
A useless snowflake ball? Are you serious? I said gold or above, and 2K listened to me and gave me that garbage uh, dog water. But whatever. Badges, every single badge I get at this point is super valuable and super important. So I can't take that for granted either. Bronze, let's see. Playbook, whatever. Jersey here. Out of the Emerald Pack, I need to pull something good. And it might, you might be like, Ty, it's an Emerald Pack. Relax. Nothing good is coming. Man, I do not care. I need to pull something soup out of this Emerald Equal Chance Pack. Let's see who I do ultimately get. Keontae George. Let's look where we are at when it comes down to the Jalen Suggs grind. We've got everything done outside of the shoe grind. So what does that mean? Well, I'm going to go back in here, look and see if we've got any extra shoes. I've got a couple of them. Really don't want to apply a diamond shoe. I guess I'll apply that gold shoe and then I'll buy a couple of shoes. Not that I really want to, but I want to have add Jalen Suggs to our squad right now. So we're going to buy three more shoes really quickly with this MT. I would not recommend you guys doing this, but I mean, look, I, I just, I gotta get Jalen Suggs. I got to get him so I can start working towards our next ultimate goal, which is Franz Wagner. Pairing them in my backcourt is gonna lead to a lot of success. I know I'm wasting a bunch of MT, but I just wanna have Jalen Suggs done and complete. It's crazy, because on my other account, I take it for granted, because I have all the shoes needed and I, I you know, don't have anything to do with them. But here I am, man, struggling, man. Struggling to really get off the ground right now. But oh well, just like that, guys, Jalen Suggs, a great point guard added to our squad. Let's go, Ruby Jalen Suggs, welcome home. Welcome to the squad. So now he's home. Next goal, getting Franz Wagner. And I'm not going to be shy when it comes down to MT. When I can get Franz Wagner, I'm going to buy him and add him to the squad. So Franz Wagner, 10,000 MT. I feel like a lot of these grinds just aren't super easy to do. I guess I can add this Tis the Season Future Equal Chance Pack. I need to grade three cards and complete an exhibition. I mean, I guess. I was going to wait to do exhibitions. I don't even know if I have enough MT to do exhibitions. I don't. I don't even have enough MT to do any of these exhibitions. This is so sad. I don't even have anything, bro. My squad really is, is so, so, so sad, bro. Okay, I did an exhibition. I think I got to claim it. And then I'm going to grade three cards. And then that will be done. I'll add another free Emerald to the squad. I don't care who I grade at this stage. 226 MT, that's done. Get 100 MT. Now, once the exhibition does come back, whenever that is, I'll get another free Emerald to add to our squad. The only thing left for me to do well is to just go crazy in Triple Threat Offline. See if I have a prize ball to crack or not, because if I do, that would be nice to combo up. No prize ball, that's fine. Let's see how quickly I can get through some games. Again, our goal today is to add Jalen Suggs and Franz Wagner. If I can do that, those those two guys are going to be a big piece to my puzzle. I got a lot to grind, and I know it's just the start. But those two guys, again, are going to be huge when it comes down to building the No Money Spent Squad series. And I know Triple Threat Offline is on a super easy difficulty right now. But I can't tell y'all how important it was that they gave me a free Ruby step. Like, it, it seems like it's such a small thing. But he is... Oh, and then I shoot that. He is going to easily get me through these games. And I don't know without him who I'd be using right now. I have no idea. Got through that game in less than three minutes, which is crazy. New Year's event pack adds to the squad. And again, anytime I have ch a chance to get 500 MT, that's going to be hard to pass up on. Easy, easy, easy MT added to the squad. Sasha, Sasha Vujicic. I add Ruby Ant somehow. I guess I get 2,000 extra MT right there. I should have enough MT to get Franz Wagner as well i mean it's crazy that this no money spent squad series has started this way already so we got enough mt for franz wagner so guess what i'm gonna buy him add him to the squad there's no saving mt when i'm trying to build my squad so jalen suggs franz wagner so here's guys what the duo looks like and why i decided to get it both of them start as a ruby both go to a diamond for 10,000 MT. Uh, and, and here's kind of both their upgrades. Jalen Suggs plus six three ball fronds plus three three ball. Ball handle for fronds goes up three for Jalen Suggs. Up five speed goes up for Jalen Suggs. Speed ball acceleration for fronds. D rebounding, perimeter defense, lateral quickness goes up as well as speed with ball, speed, acceleration, strength. And look at all the extra Hall of Fame badges that they do get. This for 10,000 MT. It's tough to beat. I see a challenge. Rebounds with Lakers. Uh, threes with Cavs players. 
Maybe that's what I need to start working on. So do I have a Lakers player that can just snag? That's the big question right now. If I do, awesome. If I, I really don't though. Like that that's the trouble. I really don't. Uh, the other one was Cavs 3. Do I have a Cavs player that can shoot the ball? None. So, I mean, those types of challenges I really can't do anything with right now. We're going to play one more triple threat offline game today and see where we stack up. And I think it's important to remember. So far in the Nobody Spit Squad series, I barely spent any time on the game. And I'm going to be building my squad for super, super cheap. I mean, and it's not going to take me a ton of time. But with the Suggs and Wagner duo, that's 10,000 MT. That's it. 10,000 MT. I literally could play 10 triple third offline games. Again, super easy to do and easily get the MT by there. I mean, it's not hard. It's not difficult. And so that's kind of the big thing that I want you guys to know and be aware of is it's not hard to build a no money spent squad and even a 10 man squad that you are going to be able to go into unlimited with. Another game in the book. Steph Curry absolutely lights out. But I'm really enjoying the start of this grind. 300 MT. See, that's what I don't want. I don't want to pass up on MT and then get like a sleeved uniform pack that I really don't care about and really don't want. You don't want to pass up on MT, but then you don't want to pass up on something better either. So it's really kind of just a tough balance that we have right there. 2024 thing, which is going to get me another firework, which is a big time deal as it stands right now. I guess I'll take a Warriors jersey and then a badge pack to uh, round things off today. I feel like we're off to a really high hot start on a no money spent squad series i locked in franz wagner paired it with jalen suggs and we're already back to 2000 mt i'm gonna do exhibitions if i can it's crazy the fact that i've already got this many amethyst but hey i'll take it lock that in let's see art school i can't do that's fine 2k tv i don't think i can do i'm missing one emerald card Stuff. How much is Terrence Man? Can I buy Terrence Man? Because if I can buy Terrence Man, I'll do that exhibition too. These emeralds are 2100, which I actually can buy, can't afford, but I don't love them as emeralds. These ones are 3000, just a little too much for me. It's just tough because I wish I could do that exhibition, man. I really wish I could, but I just don't think it's a smart thing for me to do as it stands right now. The nice part is there's another one that only takes three emeralds. And just like that, I've got, what, two exhibitions, three exhibitions going. Got a long ways to go, but we are off to a very hot start with the Diamond Duo. Jalen Suggs, Franz Wagner. That's going to wrap it up for our video today, guys. Drop a like on it. Subscribe here. Do it as always, man. I love you guys. Have a blessed day.